tell me, what was it like for you to see the incredible run of the first season of Lincoln Lawyer? Oh, it was great. Uh, you know, it was a very successful show, and I don't know, it was my first time, you know, in a TV show as a lead in an American um, show. To have that success, oh, I was very, uh, very proud and happy, you know, about it. Hello? Mickey? When you sat in the Lincoln for the first time, were you like, yeah, this feels... Yeah. This feels right. I got a lot of hunger, and I thought it was because of me, and it was... <laughs> and the car! Uh, it was the car! It was the car. <laughs> what do you say we order our hot dog? I saw it. You ready? Oh, he's having a, a the pastrami one. And what are you gonna have? Uh, you speak Spanish? Ah, no, 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 no puedo tener el clásico, pero sin el chile. Oh, oh my gosh, is this us? Carrito. This is so good, salud. Salud. You ready for this? Come on. It's time to refill the tank. What did you think of the, the original, Matthew McConaughey's portrayal of the Lincoln lawyer? Oh, I love it. He's such a charismatic actor. Of course, Matthew played the role in the 2011 film, but Manuel is putting his own spin on Mickey Holler. I have heard, read, that you actually helped kind of advocate for more of a Latin presence, Latin representation on the show. In the novel, the character is Mexican-American. Mm -hmm. So I'm just, if you're casting me, which I'm Mexican, let's just, you know, dig into that more. And I ask, oh, can I sometimes speak in Spanish, especially with my daughter, you know? Right. Um, so yeah, I think that's fun, it makes it more interested in this. I'm sorry about that, Ika. The show's success has garnered Manuel a lot of attention, and although he played it coy when it came to revealing his relationship status, he has heard it all. I don't know if you're comfortable with this, yeah, yeah, yeah. but I, people have tossed around the word sex symbol. How do you feel about that? It's like, uh, what happened to Pedro Pascal, you know? Papi, or they were calling him daddy pa or something? Yeah, da daddy, papi. Yeah, yeah. Are you prepared? How has all of this changed life for you? Or has it? I mean, personally, it hasn't changed me. And I do my work, and then I move to the ranch in Mexico with my horses, and my family treats me the same. I don't know. It keeps it real, you know?